This is the original family homestead. Holly Schalberg's family has had this farm for generations. It's more than 100 acres just outside of Caldwell and is home to a wide assortment of animals. Horses, mules, um, two goats, bunch of chickens, and a miniature pony. But just in the past week, they've added one more, a goose. You can say he's kind of adopted them. Well, not us, but the car. Yep, this honker has the hots for Holly's hot rod Lincoln. And he's very protective of it. Just look how he goes after our less than fearless cameraman. <laughs> Hope you saw his reaction. He came at me. So protective that wherever the car goes, he goes. Yeah. She says just keep driving. Yeah. See how he does here. Here he comes. He's in, he's in the air. Is he? Yep. Oh my gosh. And you can see him coming up from behind on the passenger side. Here he comes. So the first time this happened, what were you thinking? I was shocked. I, I, was, kind of, I was scared. He's right over here off our right shoulder now. There he is. There's Lincoln. Holly found out how far the waterfowl will take his affection for her car. Yeah, here he comes. The hard way. This is crazy. The day after he. I know. Um, it puts a real kink in the day. And Holly has since named him Lincoln. The day after Lincoln landed in her yard. So I go to pick up my niece at her preschool and notice, and the bird's trotting down the driveway and takes off, flies right behind me, and was keeping the pace 50 miles an hour all the way. Holly's only explanation for Lincoln's infatuation. He's in love. It, it's 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 the car. It's not me. He won't follow me to the mailbox. He won't follow me anywhere else. He will not leave this car. There are times when Holly slows down that Lincoln slides in front, putting the brakes on the drive and Holly's day. See, it makes it really difficult. He wants you to stop. She's been wanting to get her nails done for a week. I have um, red boxes that are late. I can't go to the grocery store. I can't get anything done because he monopolizes the car. So what happens when he's like right in front of you like that? You just I, kind of I, I inch just along? have to sit. Oh, really? I have to sit or I honk a couple of times, but you know, I don't know if he thinks the horn's maybe a mating call. And getting going again can lead Lincoln to other hazards. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. <gasps> oh, Lincoln. Oh. <laughs> he just stopped that truck. There, here he comes. <laughs> Yeah, he is a traffic stopper. So this has become the new normal for Holly and her car, at least for now, or at least until Lincoln finds another mate for nesting season. How you doing, bud? It's <laughs> too funny. Makes for a, a great story. Until then, Holly Schalberg will be known as the Mother Goose of Canyon County the one with a literal wingman whenever she takes her Lincoln for a drive. And she still can't go get her nails done. I still can't get my nails done. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow, yeah. <laughs> but probably not. <laughs>